हेलो इंजीनियर्स वेलकम ऑन द यूट्यूब चैनल द मशीन डिजाइन टुडे इन दिस वीडियो वी विल लर्न अबाउट द बेसिक कमांड्स इन जनरेटिव शिप डिजाइन इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी विल कवर एक्सट्रूड एंड रिवॉल्व कमांड इन सरफेस सब मेन्यू सो लेट्स बिगिन दिस इज द के टी आई वी फाइव एनवायरमेंट बाय क्लिकिंग ऑन स्टार्ट मेन्यू जस्ट हॉवर कर्स ऑन शेप शेप and then select generative shape design now uh, i have enabled the hybrid design create a geometrical set and create an ordered geometrical set uh, enter part name so for now i will just enter as surface extrude then just okay so now you are in generative shape design environment here you can see the different different menus from here we will select the command and i uh, this is are the menu menus different different i will also guide how to opt these commands from the future list this is the future list so for in first click on insert menu this is insert menu and then surface sub menu here we will click on extrude mm, but here we need a profile uh, which one we need to uh, just extrude so before uh, starting extrude we will close this uh, we can create profile from directly from here but i will uh, show you uh, how to create in a sketch command so just you can go on insert and then sketcher just cl click on a sketch otherwise you can select from directly from the future list uh, just create just click on here uh, now select a plan so i will select the plan y z now we have two axis horizontal and vertical i will just create a horizontal line you can practice with another sketch like rectangle or what you want uh, i have described in details for this uh, sketcher environment in our uh start video i will give a link in description for this video so for now just i have created a horizontal line uh, i will just uh, give dimension from here mm, this should be 20 mm and uh, length of this horizontal will be uh, 100 mm okay uh, for making it fully constrained right now this is not not fully constrained so just i will create coincident between vertical axis and this coincident and then i will just exit this uh, from sketcher environment so now i have a simple profile uh, which one want i want to uh, create extrude so again i will go in insert menu and uh, surface sub menu and click on the extrude otherwise i will uh, directly select from it from feature list uh, here extrude uh, i will if i click on this drop list so i have here extrude and revolve so for now i will start from extrude command just create extrude so now the, this is pop up window uh, it is asking for profile which one want to i not need to extrude so just click on here again then it also uh, want a direction right now this is uh, i have created a sketch on uh, y and z plan so this is consider uh, default uh, as a default the normal angle from the y z means x direction 
but if i have i want to uh, create it on this extrusion on in another direction i will uh, create from uh, select from here so just clicking right click uh, here we have option like create line or create plan and from this direction i will create so we have another option uh, compass direction as well so for now i will just uh, click on y direction so i have uh, selected the y direction so it is uh, creating an error because this uh, plane is in same direction that's why we have we cannot use so then okay i will just create it again in x component then i will uh, give a limit we can give limit like dimension up to element so we have no any uh, another element so we'll just create dimension like uh, 200 mm and limit to if i want to uh, create in uh, extend in another direction i will give like uh, 50 mm then preview then okay so now i have extruded in a simple line into a surface so i have uh, a normal surface here this is straight surface uh, if you want to practice with another surface like uh, spline or circle you can create in sketch so for now i have created a uh, simple sketch here i will use same sketch for uh, revolve command as well so from here i can just hide okay so i have this sketch again uh, if i want to create a revolve command uh, i want to use revolve command then just i can go on insert and surface sub menu then clicking here revolve or another option is just from the future option just select click here and revolve command so this is external profile here it uh, it is asking for profile and a uh, second one is revolution axis so uh, for now i will consider revolution axis just uh, our y <coughs> direction y axis just click on the y axis and profile is this is sketch so just click on here uh, by default or if you have already used this command in past so it will suggest the same value or by by default also i will just change from here i can increase it up to 360 degree by default it will take just 1 degree uh, incremental or decremental so this is this cannot turn more than 360 degree so 360 degrees ma maximum value uh, here i will just change the shading with edges so i can visual this visualize this uh, sketch uh, surface properly so another option we have if we just consider here 180 degree from one side and one uh, 150 degree from another side it will create extrusion like that so i will just create it 180 again so i have a cylinder here i can use both options here preview and then okay so now i have a cylinder and an extrusion as well so this was our first tutorial video on 
uh, generative shape design uh, we will create another uh, tutorials uh, like for uh, extrusion uh, for sphere and direct cylinder commands i hope this video helped you to understand the extrude command in generative shape design this was a basic and very useful command in next tutorial i will guide you for sphere and cylinder command in case of any doubt regarding to this or any other command you can comment in comment section thank you so much friends for giving your precious time please do like and share this video also don't forget to subscribe this channel for now bye bye